Okay, so let's have a look at uh, staking chess. So if you click here, um, currently, you're going to get 42% uh, uh, APY on chess uh, for a 10 day uh, duration. So if I click on stake now, now you need a minimum of 10 chess and a maximum of 100 chess. So it's not a great deal. You can stake. So if we go here to the price, um, it's about one for one. So a maximum of 100 is roughly about $100. Okay, so $120 effectively. Okay, so oh, I'm just going to buy 50. Okay, let's go for that. Um, Pretty slow volume. Okay. Partially fill, filled. So I've gone for 50. So that's uh, about seven and a bit. Okay. So the good thing, again, you can buy it on BUSD. So that's not going to incur any fees. Just need a little bit more. Looks like I've uh, okay. Just wait a little bit. So uh, ten days. Let's have a look at the staking option. So, so ten days minimum of ten, maximum of twenty, uh, hundred. And 30 days, obviously the minimum is 10 and it goes up, the maximum is a thousand chess. But if you have a look, the percentage is 12.15, but you will be paid out in BNB again. And as you can see, the percentage goes up to 15.52. If you do 60 days, I think the minimum, the maximum has come down a little bit as well. Oh no, it's gone up. You can actually stake 2000 chess if uh, you do 60 days and 90 days, the maximum is a thousand, so it's a bit weird how the, the maximum for 60 days goes up to 2,000, and for 30 and 90 days it's only a thousand. So I guess the 30 and 90 days are maybe more popular. Yeah, I, I suppose that'd make more sense maybe. Um, so, so the APY is adjusted daily based on the on-chain staking rewards and the specific APY is subject to the page display on the day. Interests will be distributed to your spot wallet after the redemption is completed. So if you're putting in it for 10 days, you're gonna get 42.17%. And if you withdraw early, you'll get your uh, distribution rewards, rewards uh, taken back off you. But I'm not exactly sure how, I'm guessing you would have to sell chess and get your B and B back off you that way. Because normally if you um, redeem early, they will take the distribution rewards which you've been given over several days. So let's say if, you, if you've got a 30 day locked in and you've had 15 days of um, rewards, they will take those 15 days back if you redeem early from your actual um, main chunk of money that you put in. So I'm not exactly sure how they would take it off you when it's been given out in BNB &B and you're actually staking chess. So I can only assume they'd have to sell some of your chess if you if you uh, came out of the uh, came out of it early. Let's have a look how we're getting on here. Uh, looks like I bought my chess anyway. Okay, let's have a look. So let's go to 10 days stake now. Oh, what's going on? I don't understand. Let's just uh, F5 it. Sure, I must have bought it. It doesn't seem to be there now. So stake now. Oh, there we go. We're in there now. So max 50 chess. I agree. And you click confirm. Okay, so remember this APY is, is for 10 days. 
this is the amount actually it's actually not actually showing the amount of interest i'm going to get but i'm going to get interest for 10 days okay so i'm not going to get the equivalent of 42 percent chest back so in other words i'm not going to get 21 roughly equivalent in chest back in 10 days time that would only happen if i did it for a whole year okay so apy is annual percentage yield so i just hit confirm and a subscription success so i've got 50 chests in there and that will earn me a b and b on a daily basis okay so that's staking chess on uh binance 